Hello everybody, welcome back to Valheim. So, we're just continuing on from where we left off. I don't think I've done anything much, except maybe slept. Um, I need to fill in that window, but to do that I need wood. So, what I want to do, I want to do a couple of things. Um, first of all, finish moving the stuff from over here which I think I planned to do off camera but didn't end up doing but anyway um, let's, so I'm going to demolish this that'll give us some wood for a start um, I need to move these over to the other workbench and set those up over there. So let's do that first. Since it's misty outside and we can't really see anything much. All right. So this can probably just squeeze in there. Yep. And then that's not what I wanted to do. This I need to find a spot for. Let's put it around the corner here. Get it in as far as I can. Alright, so now we have our workbench again. Um, next thing is I need to... What's in here? Oh, all sorts of stuff. Let's see, it's, that's my emergency death kit. Let's start using this one for wood and go and uh, continue on demolishing this. So I have to obviously make sure that the um, that the workbench is the last thing to go. Oh, I'll get it on when, when I finish demolishing. So I usually like to demolish by taking out the bottom layers and letting physics do the rest. Only because I enjoy watching it all fall down. <laughs> I find this a lot of fun. And then I need to get rid of the uh, floor. So now I have plenty of wood. Some of which was, is going to be used over here. I uh, accidentally demolished the workstation. It's not the first time I've done that.
All right, so I will need to flatten the ground out better. Um, let's put a, a stack of wood here. No, not like that. Like that. Pick up some more. This is going to be used for a little farm plot. I do need to flatten out the ground more. Let's just pop these here for now. I'll collect up the rest. Take it over to my other, my house. I need to get rid of that as well. Oh, I'll get rid of it in a minute. Let's go and put all this away. Um. And then the next thing I need to do is gather stone to fill in the um, this bit to make the slope more even. Of course, no, oh. that I can't even. Uh -huh. Nope. Workbench again. Thought I'd finished with that. I guess I'll need to just leave it here until I've finished making the um, animal pen on the farm. Which I'm not really going to do today. And this is going to be too far from the workbench. Yep. Right. But at least we have plenty of wood. Um, so now I need to gather stone because I haven't bested oak tea yet. And I'm putting it off for a couple of reasons. I'm hoping that um, Hilda's request will come out before I um, before I do him so that I don't have to I can turn off the raids or I can build a fence around which is probably another better option let's let's do that today Let's build a fence and gather up stone because at the moment I'm restricted to whatever stone I can pick up off, off the ground um, until I get the stag um, horn and make a uh, pick, pickaxe. Just having a quick look for some stone. I'm not going to go wandering all over the place. So the other thing is this series started as a, um, oops, that's not what I meant to do. This series ended up, started off as a, um, a building series to um, give people an idea on uh, how to build a basic home. Then I decided to make it a little bit more fancy. And now I'm going to do a let's play series or continue this on as a let's play series because um, I still have building to do but I can't do it without um, uh, uh, taking down Ike Tier and then we'll see how we go from there if you're enjoying the let's play which will still be quite a bit of building in it um, I'll uh, I'll continue up, but I need to build smelters and such so that that's not, oh yeah um, I need to build smelters and such so that I can make the 
um, uh, what's it I need to make? I've forgotten. <laughs> but I need to build smelters. I think I, I feel like I've been rabbiting on and not really saying anything. Anyway, the upshot is I need to build smelters. Um, so let's take the thing out to about some more flint. Let's take this out to about here. I don't even know if I've got the, the right... Um, uh, if I can craft what I want to craft yet. Oh yes, I can make a stake, a stake wall. So let's put a crafting bench out here. And then start building a stake wall. It's going to go all the way down to the um, water. I just want to get a couple placed here. I really could do with um, something to build it up on, but I think we're just going to have to stick with this for now. Yes, and I, t and then I need to put something under that. Normally I would put make a stone wall. Oh. I also need some more skelly bones to upgrade my armor a little bit. Alright, what are we gonna put under here? And I need some more birds. Well I've run out of wood anyway. Um I don't have the stuff I'm used to using. Let's stick half or no, full, full, even. No, half full. Does that now make it? Yes. So I would either put core wood beams. Or, um, yeah, here we go. Meals on wheels. Oh, nice, two in one go. So the creatures are coming down, but the, uh, in my experience, the boars do still sometimes come back, but not this time. Oh well. Saves me going hunting for a little bit.
Oops, stuck. That, no, wrong button. That in there. Trophies go up the top. Oh, I do have stone. Now what did I want stone for? I've forgotten. forgotten what I was doing with the stone. Oh, I know. Flatten the ground over here. Which means I need to get the hoe out. Well, not exactly flatten the ground. I'm just going to make it a smooth slope down towards the water. I need to make sure the top's flatter though because uh, obviously I need to have a little flat area for my plants and I want to build a picky pen but I can't build a picky pen until I can put a um, a, a decent fence around it because otherwise the uh, little annoying graylings and such will attack it and so do the great grey dwarfs when they start coming they attack your farm and your animals Right. Let's, let's not. All right, let's. I thought, oh, I forgot to get the, the stone out. Silly sausage. Oh, I can't even remember where I put it. There. Let's take all of it. And I think we're losing the light. It seems like such a short day. But never mind, we're doing another one. Another day. It's just, yeah, can't really see that. Let's go to have a quick sleep. In the morning we'll have something to eat. It took me so long to remember what number my bow was. Oh, that bird flew away. I need feathers. Not in there. Oh, there's wood in there too. Oh, that's for the fire. I don't know why I've got wood in two different boxes. Um, I don't have any feathers. And I need feathers. So... Uh, Unless they're in here. No. They're not here. Let's sleep.
All right, now we need to eat something. One of those, one of those, and one of those. That should give us a little bit of variety in our diet. These are the uncooked ones. I just want to have a look. Oh, okay, so it's one per. Let's just do, do half of it. I don't need to take all ten. And I don't need to take all of those. They go in there. There we are. Not really anything I can do. Let's, while we're waiting for the sun to come up, let's do a little bit on. And where did I put that wood? There. Let's do a little bit up here. So the first thing I want to do is frame the door. Because it gives me somewhere to rest the rest of it on. Not frame the door, frame the window. And I'm just going to make, oh I want, want another one of those in the center. I'm just going to make a simple um, chevron, so, well, not really even a chevron, just turn it around. There we are, it's quite a simple. Um, but we can pretty it up by giving it some dimension out here. Um, might just give the frame some dimension. Just slightly in. And again, and my hammer's gone. Everything's fixed. Yeah, not happy with that. It's not sitting in where I want it to. And I fell off. <laughs> it's interesting how you cannot be moving and still fall off. And then this one, because I want it on the ins, the um, indent on the inside has to go above it. And then this again, the indent on the inside. Hmm. Don't love that. Okay. 
and I still don't love that. I want it to be there. That's too high. All right, and then this one the same. I can't see what I'm doing. Turn around. Oh goodness me, can't see this one. Not quite. A little bit lower. There we are. And this one. That, I think, makes it easier to place the lower one. I have to go down, grab the wood. Might grab that bit too. And do the last bit, which I want a, a big one, not a small one. Now that's too low. There we go. That's as good as I'm going to do. Now, the other thing I could do if I really wanted to, I could swap these around so they're facing down and then put take this out that I've just done and then put a little porch coming out maybe we'll do that next time oops took out the wrong thing which is not uncommon for me Stairs. All right. Make sure everything's fixed again. And go and uh, finish flattening this ground. And I think that'll be pretty much today's episode. Maybe hunt for some stone. Um, and this is all, and then hunt for some birds, because this is all leading up to um, Aegir. Uh, if you remember, I'm looking for the, the center where it's um, baking up and showing me that I need to add. And three hits doesn't add it. Add some stone and flatten it out.
Add some stone. Add stone. Flatten it out. Back to the area where you know it's flat. And make sure it's all nice and flat. And that's still not going to flatten. There we go. Now this bit. What I need to do is I want to build a, a slope. So let's start the slope here. So if you remember from the village build, you hold the shift key to bring the land up to the level that you want. And then I've got some dimples there. So I need to flatten those out. And I've run out of stone, so I can't flatten any more. Let's just get it at a basic level. Um, flatten. And then obviously you um, move down a bit more. Or you can do it upwards if you want to. Um, I just find it easier for me to do it downward. Well, it's easier if you do it in level chunks and then smooth it out which is what I'm doing here it's hard to tell with the dappling of the trees <laughs> how flat it actually is or how sloped and even it is oh goodness me so this bit here I'm not happy with Oops, I know I made a mistake there. What did I do, boys and girls? I uh, tried to level it on the level I was standing and not on the level that I wanted it to be. Let's get some more stone. I think that's the, the last of the stone. Not there must be around the other side. No. don't think it is. I think it's here near the door. Alright, so that's the last of the stone. Workbench. Oh. Oh, flipping thing. They know. They must hear the um the bow. Workbench. This is a nuisance. These workbenches. Oh, 
All right. Now let's see if we can get it all evened out. Um, flatten the ground. Let's flatten it across there. That's not going to flatten. Nose that. smooth it out coming down here as well because I need to be able to get up and my hoe needs fixing and we do it again I'm only going to have a small... <laughs> that was bizarre. Bird flew straight into the ground. I'm only going to have a, a small slope here, I think. That's too steep. That'll do. Just facilitates walking up here more smoothly. Now this side, I don't necessarily need a slope going all the way down to the water. I just think it looks better. Oh, they're very lumpy and bumpy. I could have a little terraced garden along here. That's what I'll do. Because eventually I'm going to get turnips. I haven't even got carrots yet. But... Uh, because I need I need the um, bronze. I need to smelt bronze. That's what I was trying to say before. I need to smelt bronze to um, build a garden to to have the hoe to plant a garden. All right, that's it. That's all I'm doing garden wise. And I think it's getting a, probably a little bit late to go and do anything else. Let's just continue. That one I'm not going to be able to get from that angle. The drop off is too much. But this time of day is a, a good time for getting birds. And I do need the feathers. Let's take the empty the beehive as well because the honey is going to give me the stamina I need for Arctia. Don't think I'll eat. I'll wait until the morning. So I'm going to leave it here. And thank you for joining me and I'll see you next time when we uh, um, go looking for some the stuff to make the, well I need to, to hunt birds, that's what I need to do um, and look for feathers. And we're going to work a bit more on the fence while we're waiting for the sun to be bright enough. And uh, what else are we going to do?
I could get some more core wood. I have enough core wood now to build what I would normally put, see where, where I put this under the fence. I, I don't need it at the moment, but um, I, you, you could put core wood logs under the fence to make it a little bit more secure. No, he flew off, flipping bird. How many arrows do I have? Oh, I've got... No, I don't want the, to be using the fire arrows. I've actually got plenty of fire arrows. I didn't realise. I must have made them last episode. So maybe we'll, we'll work a bit on, more on the fence and get ready to do Ike Tear. Anyway, thank you for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Good night.